Okay, so <clears throat> welcome everybody to Enter Iowa's Outdoors. I will be your host today, Martin and Drake, who is assisting. We decided to come into Cedar Rapids and fish back here in the flats a little bit for some spring kitties. Okay, I suppose I better get my bait ready. Oh, let's see. Let's try our suckers first. See how that turns out. One of the things that's really key here in, uh, in early spring is you don't want to use giant baits. Okay, this right here, that's literally all the bigger of a bait you really need. Uh, I think I'll select my uh, my cast king, my cast cat. We'll put a pencil weight on that one. We've got sliders, but a lot of the times, a lot of people think that these pencil weights are really good for dragging. But what I like them for when I'm on the anchor is I will, they, they will let the fish drag the bait around a little bit more, but it'll still, oh, oh, <laughs> somebody messed with my brakes. Yep. Somebody messed with the brakes on my reel. There we go. Okay. Tighten that spool tension down just a little bit more. I went fishing with a buddy yesterday and he was using this rod too, so I'm pretty sure he messed with it. All right. Look out, Bobo. There we go. Not too far from the bank, but not close either. Let's get that down in the holder. Hate to lose a nice combo like that. All right. We're getting an awful lot of sway. I'm kind of waiting for the rope to tighten up. And I can set the mud motor down. Well, I got the mud motor on today because one, we're in shallow water, and two, the uh, 55 horse is uh, getting its getting its spring cleaning right now. So, I don't have the big motor on right now, so I just clamped the, uh, the little 6.5 on. Alright, let's wing this one to the very opposite side. Let's set it right there. Then, oh, let's get a nine footer out. We'll get a nine foot out. And I'll use this nine footer and I'll put it straight out behind me. That sounds like a good plan. All right, now that we're generally straight, I can take the mud motor. I'm gonna stick the skig down in the sand and that will keep us generally still. Right now we are only in about foot and a half, two foot of water, maybe, if that. So, when you're going for early spring cats, you really don't want to fish super deep. Because where you'll find them, Drake, what are you eating? Are you eating Aki stuff? You weird dog. When you're fishing for spring cats, you don't want to go super deep because that's not where they are. They come up into the shallows because it's warm. And they feed on shad 
on winter killed shad that have been uh, that have died over the winter and now are coming out of the ice. All right. Well, there's three rods. I only have a three rod license, so that's what we're working with. Let's tighten this one up, and I will be back with you guys when we start biting. Well, looks like we have a double, um, and I don't know which one to get. Okay, let's let's get. Oh, let's get this one first. Uh. Oh, yep, that one's on still too. Oh, this one just came unpinned. Oh, dang it. That one felt like a good one too. Okay. Well, we're gonna get this one back out. Right there. Dang it. I guess I'm gonna have to get this one now. Oh, that one feels really good. Oh boy. This one is a pretty big fish. Oh, Drake, I wish you knew how to fetch the net. Oh, he is all over the surface. Oh. Okay. Keep pressure on him while I extend the net. Oh, he ain't small. See what I'm saying? It does not take a huge bait to catch these catfish in the springtime. Oh yeah. That's a good little Channy Chan. All right, net, come here. All right. Look at you. You are just a nice female. There we go. Oh, oh boy. Hook came right out. Wow. I can barely get my hand around her. All right, well, let's see. Drake, where's dad's camera? Huh? Well, I know I'm wearing one, but Where's my phone, I should say. Tried to get the whole fish. All right, well, back you go, sweetheart. Thank you. All right. Well, there's one almost caught on the eight footer. And then one brought in on the nine footer you know what that's still a good bait i'm just gonna rehook it in a different spot oh 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 we're already getting bit we're already getting bit on this one. Oh, come on take it down watch i'm gonna i'm gonna grab this one and get ready to throw it get all set up and that thing's gonna go down that's exactly what's gonna happen. I know it. I freaking know it. Right down the pipe. Okay, well, I suppose I better just keep this net handy, huh? Just keep it on around, just in case. All right, guys, we'll see you again if we see a rod go down here. Let's see what this guy does. I think he's on there. Hold on. Hmm. 
Hold on, tighten it up. Wait him out again. Man, I wish these geese would shut up. Man, they are loud mouths tonight. Drake's in the front of the boat drooling. He's not a very good net man today. We'll get this one in nice and easy so we don't break him off. Ooh, I felt him touch a log on the bottom there. I want to get out of that, don't we? Come on, come over to this side of the boat. This side. Come on now. Another nice little one. He ain't huge, huge, but he's a fish. And they fight. Boy, do they fight. Uh, net this guy quick. Uh, get him in the boat. Need probably two or three pounds. He ain't huge. Caught that circle right in the corner though. Perfect. Oh, there we go. There's another one. Gonna let him go. Looks like we got another one on. And the geese approve. Oh, that's a good one. They haven't been getting hooked very well, except for that last one, so we are going to ease this one in a little bit. We're going to go nice and slow with him. He's not freaking out, but... Hell, I don't even think he's hooked. <laughs> there we go. He was wrapped up a little bit. No, he ain't, he ain't big. Just a little two-pounder. Come here, sweetheart. Oh, you're hooked good enough, I can just lift you out. action we got a little action that one wanted the cut sucker all right well I'm gonna take a quick picture and we're gonna send her back Ooh, it looks like we got another customer right there oh man I thought he was hooked okay we'll just set it right back down see if he eats it again had action over here. 